Hi everyone, this is Sunny Kumar from IIT BHU and welcome to our channel Code with Sunny. And today I am going to discuss the problems of February circuits 2021. And our first problem is robotic moves. Okay, so let's jump directly into the problem statement without wasting our time. So in this problem, we have been given a coordinate x, or you can say a 0 comma 0, the initial coordinate of the robot and the robot can only move along the x-axis that is uh, on increasing x or on decreasing x okay now the robot has n moves that is the maximum moves that the robot can do it uh, would be n and for each move though the following two or you can say the following three uh, conditions that the robot is going to fulfill that is either it go, it goes to the increasing x or you it goes to the decreasing x or it would remain at its current position okay now what we have to calculate in this problem is we have to calculate the summation of all the absolute values of x plus absolute values of y for all reachable x y okay so how we are going to do this problem and what would be our approach let's move further okay so basically in this problem we have been given the robots initial coordinates and we have to find the sum of all absolute values of x and y coordinates that is reachable okay only n moves is allowed okay now the movements are actually x to x plus 1 y coordinates remain same because we are moving along the x-axis and y coordinate will always be what 0 and similarly we can move to the decreasing x only movements on x-axis is allowed so let's suppose we have n equal to 5 I am going to discuss the examples okay now suppose n moves uh, is given and n is equal to 5 so it, it means that uh, maximum number of moves that robot can do would be 5 and our initial coordinates is 0 comma 0 so what would happen is suppose uh, our robot is at 0 comma 0 and suppose the uh, robot moves only on increasing x direction then the coordinates would be what 1 comma 0 in after one moves and again after say, one moves if uh, the robot goes for the second moves it would be, it would be like s yes, 2 comma 0 and again it goes up till uh, you can see the upper bound of increasing x till n equal to 5 moves has been exhausted would be what 5 comma 0 so you can say if the robot continues to move on increasing x then what would be the values oh, 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 okay so why these values is going to be like this 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 note that the y coordinate is always going to remain 0 and if we calculate this summation x plus summation y absolute values y is going to be always 0 so we can neglect this part so we are going to calculate the summation values of all the x coordinates okay so this would be our what 1 plus 2 plus 3 plus 4 plus 5 so this is basically what if you if you look at this statement carefully it is basically n into n plus 1 upon 2 so if the robot continues to move in the increasing x you can say uh, the number of values would be what n into n plus 1 upon 2 and what happens if the robot continues to move in the decreasing x it would be like 0 comma 0 then it would go up to what minus 1 comma 0 then it goes up to what minus 2 comma 0 and it goes up to what it goes up to what minus 5 comma 0 because 5 moves is allowed suppose the robot goes in what decreasing x so if we take absolute values of x and y coordinates y coordinates will always be 0 so basically we have what this okay so this would also come as n into what let me write n into n plus 1 upon 2 so what would be our answer so our answer would be what 2 into n into n plus 1 upon 2 because we have to find the sum of all the values that is reachable which, which is actually what n into n plus 1 this is our answer okay so let me uh, give us a preview for this okay suppose our initial position is what let's say we have 0 comma 0 okay now let's say we have what let's say we are going to say we have n equal to what 3 
so the, uh, the possible moves are either robot stays on the current position or move to increasing or move to decreasing so if the robot continues to move in the increasing x you can say the robot can go up to what 3 comma 0 you can see and and all the values all the coordinates between 0 comma 0 up to 3 comma 0 are reachable because we have the upper bound uh, at 3 equal to 3 comma 0 so all the values in between are obviously the reachable from 0 comma 0 and what if the robot continues to move in the decreasing x that is from minus 1 comma 0 we have the here okay now it goes up to what this is minus 2 comma 0 and this is minus 3 comma 0 so our reachable x would be what minus 3 comma 0 that is the lower bound you can say the if on the left hand side so for all reachable x y we can say uh, we can reach the coordinates from minus n comma 0 up to what up to the values you can say up to we can say reach up to the upper bound that would be what n comma 0 if n moves is allowed so our sum would be what sum of all the coordinates between these two uh, a lower bound and upper bound that is n into n plus 1 so the question uh, reduces to calculate the value of n into n plus 1 so let's move on to the code so initially i have taken the test cases and n and n what n would be denote the number of moves so our answer would be simply n into n plus 1 and this would give the correct answer okay so uh, i am going to share this code or share this solution video solution uh, uh, as soon as the contest is going to end so if you have any doubts do not forget to mention in the comment section of the video and i will ask the viewers to like this video share this video and do subscribe to my youtube channel also join my telegram channel for latest updates thank you for watching this video